All right, NT8 on the porch. Got a uh, USS Fitzgerald update. Um, not so much a John McCain update, John S. McCain. But something else has surfaced. Remember the USS Cole that got hit by a raft or a fishing boat and they pulled up alongside of them in Yemen and uh, blew the side of the ship up and killed 17 sailors? 17. 17. So it was 7 on the Fitzgerald and 10 on the USS John McCain. Oh, that's another thing. The Navy, in their infinite wisdom, has now decided to put the third John McCain, his name, on the USS John S. McCain. That traitorous bastard. Whatever. Anyway, Stars and Stripes, of all people, came out with an article a couple days ago. And I've been debating on doing a doing a video on it. So, rather than really cover it, I'm going to put the link down in the description. Make sure you take the time to read it. Because these captains are starting to speak up. Remember, when this originally happened, and the subsequent videos that I did, I said, it needs to go all the way up to the CNO. The CNO needs to be fired. And all the way down, the chain of command. Because these are the assholes that go in front of Congress when it comes to defense spending and say, oh, okay, we're good with that. We're good with that. The only thing they don't like is the uh, sequestration bills because it doesn't give them enough money at the time. But yet, You know, they want more planes, they want more ships, but they're not getting the money for the fucking training. So how high up does that go? Personally, I think it goes all the way up to the CNO, Joint Chiefs of Staff, which I said back then. This needs to go higher than just the captains, just the uh, sailors on the ship. And sure enough, Stars and Stripes comes out with this article saying, well, son of a bitch, they need to uh, hold people higher accountable. The captain of the uh, USS Cole, he was forced to retire in 2007 because he couldn't advance anymore. He couldn't get promoted. Like I said, captain is always the one responsible ultimately for the ships but they can't very well come out and say we can't do this mission because we don't have enough training so they're forced into a damn if they do damn if they don't scenario which is what I and quite a few others on here have come out and said reviewing this entire thing. It's old news so Florida Marquee won't cover it. So there's your answer to that. But anyway, please take the time. Read this article. Read it two or three times. worth to read and I guarantee you it'll make you think. So, NT8 on the porch, Fitzgerald and John S. McCain, 
I have no repair updates. But, uh, yeah, read that article. Sit back, drink a beer, have a smoke, and think about it. You'll get what I'm talking about. All right, talk to you later.